Hi, right, good morning. So I just woke up, I'm off today, and Konami dropped a sneaky data pack 4, just out of nowhere, without any introduction. Now, in my initial thought, just my opinion, I think they messed up badly with data pack 5. This is an extension, or maybe they're just rushing for the Euro DLC. I don't know what's going on. But again, dude, DLCs is always about faces, player cards, stadium boots and stuff like that. It's always about like that. That's why I don't make a lot of data pack videos. And in the meantime, as you can see, the, the patch explains certain things. And it always, at the end, it gives us this. A variation of minor adjustment has been has been implemented to each improve the overall game's experience. Uh, dude, game, my club gameplay can be as bad as it was the past, past couple of days. I mean, I have some more random videos because... <laughs> Dude, this game is frustrating me. I love this game too much, but it's frustrating me big time. Now you can read, you can mute me, mute my rant, and you know you can mute me and pause and read about all that. I've I've posted everything that is new right now, like with the Thursday update and a sneaky data pack five on Twitter and Discord as well. <clears throat> Guys, what can I say? Look, man, I'm tired of complaining on Twitter, on Discord, on YouTube, like all over the place. There's only so far so much you can go and complain without the outcome okay i can give feedback if feedback gets processed maybe on the japan hq doesn't get taken dude i'm 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 just like you the only difference is i stream and konami retweets my stream and you know occasionally they give me goodies which i do giveaways that's it dude that that's the only difference i mean yeah i'm a creator my i have an inf influence on the game and i'm never quiet about the things that need to be changed but I'm like, I have a list of things that need to be improved, dude. But my point is, I don't see the point about complaining about things that I know it's not going to change. At least not right now. I mean, whether you like it or not, at the moment, all we get in is new player faces, new player cards, more legends, more variations of legends. Now we have new iconic moment legends, you know? So... It's kind of addictive. I'm addicted to the game. Like, right now, I have a solid team. I almost have every single legend. I'm lucky I have a lot of supporters on the stream. And again, man, I tweet new stuff as an update. I've always do that. Like, it, it's not me promoting the game in a way. I'm just tweeting any update because people follow me for past updates. So I tweet them in a way. And I play the game because it's my favorite childhood game. Like, I don't know why I'm justifying this. Because a lot of people... Uh, would say you're complaining but you're still playing and buying coins well dude i'm an original piss head okay it, it it it's a game that i love and sadly there are things that i have to deal with it, it it's part of something that you love i mean uh, passes could be uh, like any other game that you may not be happy with uh konami could be another company you may not be happy with just like many other companies so you can't have a perfect game but uh, the problem is right now in my opinion, dude, I don't have any inside information. In my opinion, good changes, big changes will come for PS2022. And in my opinion, again, dude, just my experience throughout the past five years since the My Club launch, even for PS2021, I don't think there's going to be major changes. I hope I'm wrong. I hope I'm wrong. Okay? <laughs> but I'm just saying. So at the moment, really... I don't see the point of me complaining and ranting anymore. It would just make me look like a negative Nancy. Because I can complain and have my wish list and do all that jazz. It's no point. It's no point. They keep giving us new player cards. They keep giving us new faces. They're just making changes of things they can do. Whether it's a budget limit. Whether it's just greed. I mean, the push for coins is going like beyond. Really bad. Without giving much content back. And But in my opinion, if you compare it to Ultimate Team, at least you get what you put in. But still, you shouldn't be restricted too much with coins only. Like, for example, we have so many agents right now this week. I'm implementing the new data pack and the Thursday hype right now. And all these agents are with coins. Now, the reason why there were coins, because you have a chance to get 100 weighted Mpape out of 8 players. Okay? If they make that GP, everybody will have the fucking beastliest teams in a way. Because remember, we used to be able to farm millions of GP and people were complaining about everybody's got a beastly team, you know, without spending a dime. So th there's always going to be complaint. I am never with the fact that the push for coins is going too far. Not just Pez, man, every game. 
what bothers me the most in my next video I'll be talking about is this um, balanced play field is going too far. I have like a 30 minute video. Uh, this is going to be an rant video. And then after that, I'm actually going to talk about how to overcome these balanced play field as much as you can. Because it's always good to rewatch your game as well. So these are the new cards that's been dropped. Uh, the iconic moment legends, uh, FC Bayern iconic legends. And as you can see, I had the worst in my six or five months the pace has been released. Last week has been a terrible week for me. I mean, I, in the same week I beat my club rank one, I got my ass handed to me against 500 rated guys. Now, hallelujah, we're getting a free iconic moment Maradona. It, dude, it's good to get a player like that for free, especially if you don't have time to farm GP or buy coins, etc. But for some reason, I don't know if I'm if I'm miserable right now, if I'm hurt, how where the game is going direction wise. But the free Maradona, I'm grateful, but it really doesn't make me happy, because I just want some impact on the gameplay of my club. But I'm wasting my breath. It's not gonna happen. So these are the player of the week. Uh, imagine if you do one spin 79 pens and you get Mbappe. You won't be complaining. And then we have the European, whatever this new card is called. Again, more OP players that the game cannot handle. Defenders can't handle these guys. We got the iconic moment, FC Bayern. By the way, I am just updating you guys with what's new, okay? Uh, because uh, <laughs> this is not me saying, hey man, this is Data Pack 4, let's focus on, on gameplay. Don't expect legends and stuff like that. No, this is just the overall update for Data Pack 4 right now. I'm giving you information. Some of you may be uh, at work. We don't have information about it or anything. And gameplay-wise, dude, I'm not going to fool you making crazy, insane, fancy tutorial based on offline. That shit's not going to work on my club. Being honest with you. That's why I don't make tutorials based on offline. And in my upcoming video, especially from next week, I'm going to focus on more gameplay. And, I mean, look at that. Those fucking beautiful cards. Now we have Romanique, who's even better than a normal Romanique card. Because these iconic moment cards, most of them are 100% better than a normal Legend card. So, <laughs> I wonder if they're going to be on B form. I actually didn't check. It, Puyol, I think if you make a Legend team, Puyol would be useful. And yes, I'm not bothered about it. What am I going to do? Finesse Joblin? Online? On my club? Mm, it's not going to happen, man. This is not offline. We're not talking about offline here. So, uh, share your thoughts in the comment down below. Easy with the rage. It's not good for your health. I'm pretty sure most of you guys are as frustrated as me, you know. I'm not sitting here to insult people and absolutely trash the game to try to be negative to win a, a negative people or try to be overly positive to win a positive people's voice. I'm not a pissed politician, man. I just woke up a sneaky data pack five and I did not expect anything apart from some more new cards and faces. I'm not disappointed. You know, I'm, <laughs> I'm, I'm not disappointed in a way that I wasn't expecting much changes. And it's not okay to not expect more changes. But what are you going to do? What are you going to do? I can, I can fucking scream all day long. What are you going to do? I try to my voice to be heard as much as I can. But uh, yeah, we got the free Maradona. Probably going to level them up to level, I don't know. Does he go to level 1000, this one? So yeah, that's pretty much about it, guys. Um, we're gonna be, I'm going to be streaming tonight. Hopefully the My Club gameplay is a little bit fixed, a little bit, you know. I'm tired of my ass is getting dominated against anybody who has lower rated than me and lower win ratio. I'm literally tired of it. It's uh, <laughs> Try and make sense out of things. Try and know my mistakes as well. Anyway, till next time. Ciao for now. Cheese on toast.